Hey everybody, Fred's Reviews here. Welcome to a brand note to another uh, LEGO Ninjago Crystallized Set Review. So in the previous review, I did uh, Zane's uh, Golden Dragon Jet. Um, and so in this review, I'm going to be doing uh, the Crystal King. H is 9 plus set number 71772 which is a piece count of 722 pieces while the price range was about $8 so $79.99 so yeah unfortunately I'm unable to show the box because the box is too big too big so characters include Lloyd, Harumi a Vengestone Warrior and a Vengestone Guard and the Crystal King himself. So, before we jump into the minifigures, let's go over the instructions real quick. Instructions are massive. Win Lego with Lloyd. And of course, advertisement for all the other crystallized sets. Sets that I still kind of want to get. Maybe. Who knows? Just gotta wait and see. Anyway, that is it on the instructions. So now, oh shoot. Ah, uh, come on. <clears throat> so now let's go over. Main figures. So starting with Lloyd here, he is pretty cool. Uh, he gets his new ninja outfit. He has a golden sword and armor piece right there, and of course his classic standard sword. And also, he does not come with his hair piece, but he does come with his standard Ninjago movie face. So uh, yeah, so that is it on Lloyd. And finally, we have Harumi, the return of Harumi. Harumi was not really dead this whole time after season 9. So basically, she's been alive this whole time. So she faked her death. She survived the fall. And uh, yeah, she has two transparent pink katana blades, which are new in this color. It's so cool. And also, she has purple armor to show that she is once again uh, working for uh, the Crystal King and she has a new face but she still has that red decal on it as well as well as her hair piece as well and let's do a little comparison here's a uh, Avatar Harumi from uh, 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 Prime Empire. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, when she's in that outfit that looks a lot like Kill Bill. So, yeah. And then, of course, her Season 8 slash Season 9 outfit. Which is pretty dang cool. Her Sons of Garmadon outfit. So, yeah. But anyway, that's it on... Harumi. And here we have another Vengestone Warrior. Nothing too different. One transparent pink arm, one transparent pink leg. The head is still one mold, and he just has another crystal sword piece as well. And uh, yeah, that is it on the Vengestone Warrior here. And next up we have here is a Vengestone Guard. He has the armor, the trans pink armor, and uh, two transparent pink arms and one transparent pink leg. And he has a double bladed this time, double bladed crystal blade, which is pretty cool. So, uh, yeah, that's it on the Vengestone Guard. And finally, and finally we have 
the Crystal King, aka the Vengestone Buyer, aka the Overlord. The Overlord is back. And he has some Vengestone. He's been the, I guess he, he's been the, the Vengestone Buyer this whole entire time. Everybody wanted to know who was the Vengestone Buyer, and it was like, oh, no, no. Anyway, he's got his, uh, his, uh, uh, his rib cage out and the symbol for the Overlord, and he has this pretty cool mask that's kind of like an Oni, but this is like a new mask as well, and this is like a new samurai helmet as well. So if you lift up the mask here, you can see his face. And uh, he also has a trans uh, pink sword and a lightning bolt. So yeah, that is it on the Crystal King. Oh fuck! Man, I just forget about it. And that's oh yeah right. Um, I forgot to do this uh, comparison to the Legacy uh, set of the Overlord that comes with the Overlord Dragon. So yeah, he does not have the floaty bit this time. So yeah, so that's basically it on the Crystal King, and also it for all the main figures. So now let's go over the Crystal King mech? I would call it. Yeah, if you could call it a mech. But yeah, first things first, we've got to take all these weapons off of them. Open these up. Sorry, my cat's meowing. Open up the rib cage and you can put him in like so. If I can still, like, get him in there, I don't even know if it's even possible if he can even... Okay, I think, I'm pretty sure he can fit. If not, then what the fuck? Okay, I'm just gonna put him... Just sitting. <clears throat> and then... Boom, 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 boom. And he's good to go. Uh, the main issue about this bit, about this set, is of course the legs. The front legs here are not poseable. They are connected by two Technic beams, which kind of sucks. So it's kind of the same deal with the bottom legs of the uh, um, Void's Titan Mech from Season 11. But overall. I really like this build. I love how all the pieces are like used in some way. I I really like it. Even though the set does come with a lot of stickers, it is pretty cool and a lot of transparent pink too. So it's like very, very cool. I love the design on these hands. It's just so cool. It's like you can put the staff on with either hand and uh, yeah. And not only that, but uh, the staff piece here is a brand new piece so it's like it's perfectly usable for CCBS stuff which is pretty cool but like yeah um, also I really like uh, I also like his helmet it's like kind of reminiscent of the uh, mask of ultimate power from Bionicle G2 so yeah that is also pretty cool so uh, yeah Ugh. He also has a tail. So, yeah. So, in a way, in this form, he's kind of like a centaur. So, yeah. So, I guess with that, that is it on my review on the Crystal King. Do I recommend this set? Yes. Even though this is the only set that you get Harumi with so uh yeah highly recommend it definitely get it and uh yeah also comes with a bunch of pieces extra pieces and also a brick separator so yeah so i guess join me next time as i'll probably be reviewing either the golden dragon or nia's samurai x mech so yeah.
And anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give this video a like. If you liked it a lot, also subscribe it helps too. Don't forget to turn on that notification bell so you can stay notified whenever I post a new video. How much my goal? 100k subs before 2022 ends. So yeah. Anyway, that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. But friends, views us. You guys in the next video. See you guys later. Bye bye.